travel while learning about dozens of animals. 12 News reporter Jackie Prager is live at the Double Tree by Hilton where the first natural history exhibition is underway. Jackie. Well, Chloe, I'm surrounded by more than 30 different types of animals. There's exhibits all around me. And right now I'm joined with uh, animal educator Cameron McSheffrey. Thank you so much for joining us. Can you tell us a little bit about what's going on here with all these animals and that you can get up close and personal with? Yeah, so this weekend we have our, our natural hec uh, exhi uh, history exhibition here. Um, and we do uh, educational programs throughout the day and you're able to hopefully interact with a bunch of animals that you wouldn't normally get to on a, on a regular basis. And one of the cool things is here that you can actually go up and touch them and it's not only in the enclosures but you can actually touch them and you want to make sure that people can conquer their fears. Yeah, abs absolutely. That's uh, we, we love helping people get over their fears. That's and so you brought one of your special friends with me. One of my fears are spiders and so now who do you have with you now? Here I have Fuzz Lightyear who is our Chilean rose-haired tarantula uh, who happens to be one of the most feared animals uh, we generally have here. And uh, so now I'm gonna take this in. Uh, what would you recommend to people like me who have never touched a tarantula or even been this close to one before? Honestly, you barely even notice it on your hand. All right, so let's give it a try. So it's gonna crawl on my hand right now. We're doing good, it's moving on. A little shaky, but it here just kind of sits there, just like that, doesn't want to move. And so what are some misconceptions about this guy here? Uh, that they're dangerous. There's actually no such thing as a deadly tarantula. They don't exist, even though they're venomous. That does calm my nerves, but I have to say, I I'm shaking a little bit inside. But uh, this is really cool, and anyone is able to interact with these animals like this. Absolutely, yep. Any anyone's able to. Awesome. Well, you can get the chance to interact with animals just like this and many more all weekend. All you got to do is come down and check out this event. Live in downtown Binghamton, Jackie Prager, 12 News. Wow, Jackie, 